Welcome to our tutorial series on PFSense firewall installation and configuration. In this part one video, we'll guide you through installing PFSense in a virtual machine using VirtualBox. Stay tuned for part two, where we'll dive deeper into configuring client and server machines, along with firewall rule setup. Before we begin, let's set up our network configuration. We'll simulate a test environment with a WAN interface on the 192.168.17.x-24 network and a LAN interface on the 192.168.1.x-24 network. First, head to the PFSense website and download the firewall software. Once downloaded, decompress the file on your desktop using software like WinRAR. Next, let's create a new virtual machine. Allocate one CPU, one gigabyte RAM, and a 10 gigabytes HDD for testing. Ensure the VM has two network interfaces, one for LAN and one for WAN. Connect them to internal networks named Internet 1 and Internet 17, respectively. Installation is straightforward. Follow the on-screen instructions and after completion, stop the VM. Reset the VM to boot from the hard drive, then restart. Now, let's configure the WAN interface. Set its IP address to 192.168.17.1/24 with a gateway IP of 192.168.17.1. Note that in real scenarios, WAN IP addresses would be assigned by DHCP or by your ISP. For the LAN interface, default settings are sufficient at this stage. Finally, let's perform basic testing. Ping both WAN and LAN interfaces to ensure they're functioning correctly. 
Once confirmed, our basic setup is complete. That wraps up part one of our PFSense installation series. In part two, we'll delve into configuring client and server machines, as well as setting up firewall rules. Stay tuned.